don't necessarily agree. Like, I think that there are some women in other countries that that's what they're taught to do. Yeah, like, culturally. Yeah, culturally. So it's like, and you know what I'm saying? It's like, okay, we are taught that. I was kind of taught this too. Like, when you're married and you have a husband or whatever, you are supposed to cook, yeah. bring the food to your husband, mm-hmm. and do all these things. And, yeah. you know, it's like, okay, but, you know, it, when you live and I'll say this, an American lifestyle, things change a little bit, especially when you have to work, mm-hmm. when both people in the household work. Yeah. You know, when your husband is not making all this money and now it's like you both have to work. Whoever, you got home three hours ago. You know what I'm saying? I just got home. You expect me to cook? My mother and my father were separated for 18 years. From the time I was in kindergarten to the time... To my senior year in college, so that's eighteen years, and <laughs> I'm laughing. Anytime my father came to her house, she cooked. Every time, every time she made that man some meat. Every single time. When they got back together and lived under the same roof, she brought his food to him. He ate first. He he got the first plate. My father passed away three years ago. October 25th, 2020. The same date as my daughter's birthday. And... I work, I, I'm a single father, and I work um, eight hours, whatever number of hours, and I cook for my kids every single day. I make breakfast, I make lunch, make dinner. Every single time, every, oh my God, the, 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 I can't even say these modern women. Because because what is the age range of a modern woman? Yeah, I mean, you would think, well, below 30. But but that ain't true. Because I've heard 70-year-olds sound just like an 18-year-old. Could that be the grandma, right? So w- w- wouldn't the granddaughter sound like grandma? My whole point is, you could just say any woman that is alive. But not all women. Right? Because not everybody got the same background. Everybody ain't got the same culture. But the ones that are in America in abundance, I've heard, you know, about this cooking shit. And it's a flex for some women. I ain't say all. It's a flex for some women to be like, I don't cook. (laughs) Nigga, then you shouldn't eat. You know what I mean? Why should you eat if you don't cook? I mean, they're just flat out ignorant and lazy at the same time. It's ignorant to not know how to feed your damn self or having to depend on somebody else to feed you. Regardless if you're going to buy, you still depend on other people to feed you. That is ridiculous. And lazy that you don't, you ain't never took the time to find out how to do it. But you can sit your ass down and be the first one to get a plate. Boy, good God, man, I don't know what kind of people's y'all is out here. I don't, a man should know how to cook. They don't, I don't, if you are a human being and you eat, you should know how to cook. I don't understand how a motherfucker love, love to eat, love food, but can't cook a damn thing. Can't boil water, as they say back in the day. That I mean, you know, it's a flex for some people. To be like that. Some uppity, entitled, useless human being. You can't even feed nobody. It's a flex to be able to feed people. My my family, my grandmother used to feed a community. I don't understand y'all out here at all. I wasn't going to say anything. I, 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 it'd be so... You got to pick your battles. You got to pick your battles out here. I wasn't going to say anything about this. I've just heard it so much and it's just... It makes no sense to me.
It's just, it's not even, so like, even if, if you can't cook and your husband can cook, well, y'all supposed to eat out every night, y'all gonna be, y'all gonna be dead. You gonna get, you gonna be a diabetic with the quickness and your children. Like, that just makes no sense. I'm too tired to cook, but you ain't too tired to eat. That, that's, that's ridiculous. 